Hey guys, this is Sam from MyCorgi.com and I'm going to review the new Roomba for you today. You can get one for about $299. However, since I got a 20% off coupon from Bed Bath & Beyond, I got mine for $240 something dollars. If you have owned the previous generation before, you would recognize the song. And nope, they have not changed it. And the second thing that you'll notice is the noise level is significantly reduced. There is a long strip of sensors in the front of the room. This is something that the previous generation didn't have. That's why they had trouble with bathroom rug, electrical cord, and of course my piano. So the new sensors have helped eliminate all those problems. The new Roomba doesn't get stuck, therefore no more burnout motors. The new Roomba is a lot smarter, it automatically adjusts itself from carpet to tiles. The bristles in the corner have increased from 2 to 5. Just before the Roomba hits the wall, it actually reduces the speed so that the impact is not as severe. This is Vienna, and as you can see, she is not bothered by the new Roomba. Okay, this is the cleanup part. I have actually used the Dyson earlier this morning, and this is what I get from a Roomba. The new dustbin actually makes cleanup a lot easier. All the hair actually get trapped by all those fine tooth. The dust is at the bottom, and you can see the yellow part is actually the filter. Okay, let's check out the bottom of the Roomba. iRobot have completely redesigned the brush, so it's actually a lot easier to clean. They have done such a great job that the hair does not get into the internal parts or the bearings anymore. That's all folks. Message me if you have any questions.